Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. As you guys have all seen by the title of today's video, I will be showing you my entire designer handbag collection because I do have a slight obsession for handbags and like every time I look online in the shops I will always be found looking at handbags because I just love them so much and, and I love adding a new handbag to my collection all the time. But before I get into this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below and please subscribe to my channel as well if you are new. But yeah, without further ado, let's get on the video. Just before we get into this video, I do just want to say that a lot of these handbags in my collection are fake sign items. I do buy a lot of them off Vova, so before you all say that I'm spending a lot of money on designer handbags, all of these apart from a few are fake designer which means that they are a lot cheaper compared to like the real designer items you know what I mean because to be honest I could not afford half of these handbags because like I'm only a student and and I am on minimum wage as well so yeah but first handbag in my collection which I have had for a good year or so now which I am so excited to show you because I just love it here is my gorgeous nude Lady Dior handbag which I got off of it. This handbag I have had for a year. I do take it out for nice meals before the lockdown happened. I think about I took it away to Liverpool for my birthday. I did get some lovely compliments on this handbag because it is super gorgeous. It's going to kind of like to show you further back if that makes it easier for the camera. The real item retails for around two and a half grand but obviously I can never justify spending that on a real lady or handbag. I think I bought this for like £45 but it's the best £45 I've spent. I only really wear this handbag for special occasions because as I said it is more of a dress you up like handbag for special occasions, weddings, like meals, going out somewhere. But yeah, um, I love this handbag a lot. I love the gold detail on it. It does have CD engraved on the gold like handle area. And you just actually spell Dior on the little key rings. It actually says Dior on this bit here. I don't know, I don't know if you'll see. And then um, here is a button, um, like opening bag. Does that make any sense? Like honestly, I'm so clueless um, to describe handbags sometimes. But inside it just has um, the Dior like print inside, and it's like so lovely and luxurious inside. And it also has like CD inside on the zip and also stitch onto the inside of the bag but this handbag I will be able to love and cherish for a very long time hopefully and for £45 it does look very real compared to the other Lady Art handbags on the Dior website but I do love Dior as like a designer brand but it is very very expensive so that is why I usually opt for the cheaper option but yeah this handbag I do love a lot and I do just admire it so much. It's super pretty, so it's the first handbag in my collection. So next handbag in my collection is something which I actually got for Valentine's Day and I love it so much. So here I do have this gorgeous pink Valentino handbag. I did get this for Valentine's Day off my lovely boyfriend Scott and every time I went into House of Fraser or like looking online for this handbag I was just admiring it so much. It's super pretty. The colour is more of a like a darker corally kind of pinky colour. Super pretty. I don't actually own any pink handbags so this is actually like first ever pink handbag I have in my collection. Um, I love the gold detail on it. It does have a V for Valentino hand on there and I love the gold tassels on it. It also has a gold chain like I love pink and gold together so much, like it's just like my favourite ever combo ever, like it's so pretty. Um, and you open it up, you just have um, a little clasp to open it up and then inside, it is a very small handbag inside but it's pink inside and it has it is print inside of the bag as well but this handbag I will probably wear more for like days out. If I'm, if you only need to be my purse with me, I can fit in this handbag, it's my purse. But yeah, um, I've already worn it a couple of times. Like, I take it to beginning trips with me, home bagging trips. Yeah, um, shopping trips really. Um, 
in lockdown especially, um, a day out for me is B&M um, and Asda or home bargains probably. But yeah, um, I love this handbag a lot and it's perfect for keeping your purse inside and I love it so much, it's super pretty. The next handbag in my collection is again something which I have probably had for quite a while now and like it's stayed in perfect condition, I'm obsessed with it. It is a Louis Vuitton triple pouch bag or something. What's this bag actually called? I forgot what it's called but um, it's a pink strap one. Honestly this pink strap is so lovely like look at this like the pink strap is my favourite pink strap ever like if you guys know me you will know that I love my pink um I did buy this bag on Volvo for like £30 and it was the best £30 I have spent this handbag is so handy because it does have like three pouches this one I keep putting coins in very handy if you're paying with cash at a shop or something like you will keep your coins in there, notes, you open it up and it's just like a perfect like, circle little bag which is a bit awkward to open actually, I'm not going to lie but it's just like a, a tiny brown colour inside and it's perfect for keeping all your little coins or, or jewellery in there if you want to keep jewellery in there there's two more bags on here, a smaller one and a bigger one and I keep the front one for putting my lipsticks in so like my lip liner, lipsticks, lip gloss sometimes like, but what else do I keep in this, like jewellery, like highlighter even maybe sometimes and then the back one I, I usually keep a purse in there some pads if I'm on my period you know what I mean um but this bag is really really good for like if you want to go on a proper shopping trip if you're going away somewhere and want a handbag for keeping like bits and bobs in there and the strap is a lovely gorgeous pink colour these handbags are very in trend at the minute as well and it also has a gold chain and also gold like hooks and everything on it. This handbag is 100% a good favourite of mine. It does look very real as well. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It does look very real compared to the the real sign item. But look, but obviously this one is a fake designer item because I could never afford it. Because I think the real bag of this is over a thousand pounds, which is a lot for like. A little handbag really, not gonna lie. So the next handbag in my collection is actually a Gucci handbag. So I think I only have one Gucci handbag in my collection and I recently bought this off over. I think I bought it for the first time today. So this is the Mini Tan Dionysus Gucci handbag. This handbag is super pretty. Like, personally for me, I am not a huge fan of Gucci handbags. A lot of them are very like out there, quite ugly sometimes as well. I'm sorry if I offended some of you guys but I would often opt for like a Louis Vuitton handbag or like a Dior handbag but I did see this on Volvo for £23 and I was like oh my god yes. The quality of it is amazing. It has a snake clasp on it. Tan underneath it has the Gucci logo and I usually wear this handbag for like shopping again it is a very small handbag inside but the interior of this bag, oh my god, the colour is super pretty. Right, it's quite hard to open mine but here, oh, here, I actually have my little purse in here. But inside, like it's like a, a velvety soft material. It does say Gucci inside. I only keep my purse in this because it is a very small handbag inside. But yes, this handbag is very pretty and they do do all sorts of colours in this but yeah. I love this handbag a lot and I will get a lot of use out of this as well because it's just like a handy small handbag to have in your little collection as well so that's why I love having this one in my handbag collection. Next up I do have another Dior handbag. This is the Dior Print Saddle Bag. I, I recently bought this off over as well and I have been wearing it so much. It's so spacious inside. The Dior Print as well, can I just say like I honestly am obsessed with it. Like, Dior is my, Dior is one of my favourite brands as I said earlier in this video like I love the gold detail on it, it does say CD in gold engraved on there and it also does have a little handle for if you want to wear it like on your shoulder which is quite tangled actually I don't know why it's like that but yeah so there's like another little handle on it oh there we go so like you can obviously you'll wear it like this so if you can see that or it does have a like another little um oh my god it's so messed up now right and it also does have um another strap for it again it is the original Dior print 
and it says Christian Dior on the inside of the of that as well but it's like so spacious inside so I can like I keep my purse in here, my jewellery, earrings, what else, makeup, oh I do have that, that's the receipt inside, I've obviously been spending a bit of money in Elster but yeah and it also says Dior inside, it also has a zip inside of it as well but this handbag is one of my favourites again, it's very stylish, it's very trendy again um, I've only won this, I've only won this a handful of times because I've only just I've recently purchased it so like I will get a lot I will get a lot of use out of this and over the shoulder handbags are very useful for like if you're going on a nice walk somewhere shopping again it's just ideal for pretty much anything really but yeah I love this handbag a lot and it's just gorgeous next up I do have the Louis Vuitton Neverfull um, logo handbag I think I've had this for a year and as you can see the handles are pretty much breaking off I use this as a college bag and I think I actually bought it in both for £20 but um, you can definitely tell it is a fake sign of handbag as the stitching is yellow and obviously the handles are breaking and if it was a real sign of handbag the handles would not be breaking I do actually really want to get a real one of this handbag because they are so spacious inside it also has like another pouch inside for like makeup or whatever you want to put in there and it is super spacious it's also striped inside so this handbag I Used for college, if I'm going on holiday as well. I think about it, I use this as my holiday bag for keeping like all the bits and bobs in there, like sunglasses, sun cream, stuff, you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, but this handbag is um, an essential in my collection, especially if I want to put a lot of things or if I'm going away somewhere. They're very useful indeed, and it is a classic handbag in a lot of people's collections I will say finally last but not least I do have another Louis Vuitton handbag because honestly it is one of my favourite designer brands I will say now, this is the black logo Louis Vuitton Felical bag or something and this bag is just so classy I love how it's all black and then just have like a gold chain like gold and black together again it's just like so classy like i do love gold and pink gold and black gold and pretty much any color really but this handbag i've probably had for the longest time i think i've probably had it one and a half years this handbag is perfect for keeping your cards um an idea with you because it does actually have like a little card holder inside which is so useful it's actually eight card slots so i do use this handbag as a purse like as well sometimes because like it's so useful and then just have like another pouch in it where it has a zip so like you can keep all your cash in there or coins which is so nice and again it does have the lovely logo on this i have had this handbag for quite a while and it's so handy for like if you're going to the supermarket and you need your card with you um yeah like shopping if you go on the walk it's super pretty and you just have a gold button which says Louis Vuitton it also has the logo inside in gold but yeah this handbag is a classic in my collection and it's a perfect length on me as well like I love it so much anyway guys here is the end of my designer handbag collection honestly I really hope that you guys have enjoyed looking at all my handbags I am obsessed with all these gorgeous bags because I do wear them on a daily basis. I like to mix and match my handbags a lot of the time because I just love them and adore them so much. But I really hope that you guys have enjoyed. If you have, make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below and please subscribe. I'd love to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of April. So if you could, please subscribe to my channel because it would really mean the world. But yeah, I will see you all in my next video. Bye everybody.